Hey guys, and welcome back to the Sims 3 Legacy Family Challenge, Part 6. And I have a little bit of explaining to do. I tried to record this before, but my computer froze up on me, and so I lost a bit of what I had recorded, unfortunately. But anyway, uh, some of you suggested that, uh, you know, since Juliana was related to Sirius Black, that I put him in the town so that they could meet, and I did that. And so they have become friends, and they, um, what you missed was, you know, she just went ahead and got up, and um, we, there was a gem that she collected in her yard, which, you know, we had a, um, we had a, a gem that spawned there. So what she collected was a was a diamond worth 100 and 136 bucks, which we can we might be able to use in our um, alchemy stuff. But anyway, so she got up, she got something to eat, and then um, where I put Sirius was uh, there was actually a house that was pretty much right next door to hers, and it was a, a nice house. So they're neighbors, really, they're neighbors, and so they met, they um, started talking, and they became friends pretty easily. Now here is what he looks like. And I could not get him to, you know, those of you that are big Harry Potter fans, um, you know, obviously when you read the books and see the movies and stuff, he is much the worse for wear because of circumstances that he was in. But um, now the way I have him set up and the way he is set up in our writers group or writing group that I told you about that that I'm in, um, you know, that's Harry Potter based that that he's like one of the main characters in and stuff. Um, I tried to get him to look like he might have done like pre Azkaban or whatever kind of thing, um, you know, because by the time the way we've got him set up in our group and here, you know, he's got a lot of his vigor back and, and he's pretty much the same, the same as he was before. I mean, he's still pretty, you know, he still has obviously has memories of being, you know, in, in Azkaban and stuff. Um, for those of you that know the Harry Potter stuff, you know what Azkaban is. And, um, but for those of you that don't, um, Sirius Black was a character who was, uh, a, uh, convicted of a crime that he didn't commit. And so he ended up in uh, wizard's prison, which is a really, really bad place to be. And, uh, so anyway, he, um, obviously he's now in the books, you know, he had a, uh, things didn't turn out so well for him, unfortunately, but the way I've got him set up here and the way we've got him set up in our group, um, He's a, it, it turned out a lot better for him and, uh, you know, he's a much happier person for it and stuff. So, um, yeah. So <laughs> anyway, that's, uh, that's my story and I'm sticking to it. And I will be doing a special on him because he's actually one of my favorite Sims, but I tried to get him to look pretty close to what he might look like. And I mean, I, he, he turned out okay. He's not exactly like how I would have wanted him, but for, for the tools that I had to work with, I think he turned out pretty well. So anyway, what they're doing is, uh, he and Juliana are just having a shootout on the soccer, <laughs> on the soccer court here. Oh, <laughs> they're having a little shootout on the soccer court here. I'm going to turn that down just a little bit. And, um, so we've got them in a group outing and stuff. So, oh, she caught it. So yeah, we're having them in a group outing and stuff and they, they're having a really good time. Yep, they're having a really good time, and they're gonna. I'm gonna have them join the hot dog eating contest here in just a little bit. Yep. So, but we're gonna spend a lot of time with him, and we're gonna. We're just, you know, we're just gonna have a good time. So they're gonna change. Oh, I guess are they done? Oh yeah, participate in eating contest. Okay. Yeah, I must have had that set up for them because they're gonna go ahead and do that. And I'll have them take a greeting card picture as well, but let's go ahead and turn this thing around. Oh gosh, it's raining. All right, um, let's go ahead and have her pick this wildflower. Um, pick this. And then participate in an eating contest with I want to participate with Sirius, and I want to participate with this guy here. And it's raining. It's going to rain. I think we're going to end up having to go someplace else. So we'll pick this. Oh, my. And we better go ahead and sell it, because I don't want her to get an allergy from it. And it's worth 600 bucks, so that is a good thing. Oh! I don't think we better do this. I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna have to go someplace else out of this out of this uh, storm here. Let's go to the casino together. 
Now, when I tried to record this before, they actually did do the hot dog eating contest and Juliana won, but I don't have that anymore. And it wasn't thundering, so <laughs> it was not thundering. So anyway, yeah, we're going to go ahead and go here, um, visit here with our group because we don't want anybody, oops, we don't want anybody to die. Come on. And they're in the cab, thank goodness for that. Now she does have to pee and they're starting to get a little hungry, so we're gonna go ahead and, and come in here to the casino. Woo! Yep, go ahead and come in here. And we need to load up. We need to load it up. All right, so we need to find her a bathroom and then we'll order some food. But yeah, we definitely need the bathroom and I hope I've got the right one here. Let's use this. If not, we'll have to go to the other one. All right, yep, this is the ladies. And then let's go ahead and order, we'll go ahead and, we'll go ahead and order some food. I should go and get rid of this nectar register because we don't have a nectar rack to to get at. So full moon, just dandy. All right, can't we buy anything? Let's go ahead, let's go into this register here. Uh, okay, buy food. There we go, buy food. This is the one we want. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, let's go ahead and buy some ceviche for 50 bucks. <laughs> And it's just raining, thundering and raining. All right, so we'll let her finish that. Ooh, okay, very hot. <laughs> now let's see if we can find, I wanna see if we can find uh, Sirius here. Okay, let's go ahead and disband the group because I don't know where he is. So I think she had a really nice outing Okay, the group outing was fantastic. No, epic was the word. Wait, that's not the way to describe it either. <laughs> Legendary is the only way to describe it. Every group should have an excellent groupie. Okay, so yeah, I guess Sirius was, uh, let's see, I really enjoyed myself. We should hang out again uh, in the future. Okay, so yeah, because I, I think I gave, uh, yeah, I Gave, because I've been playing them for a while, so I gave um, Sirius, uh, like, the excellent groupie thing, and because he really does like to be with people, and he really does like to just sort of, you know, hang out and stuff, so, yeah, he does have the excellent groupie thing, and, yeah, so, but I will be doing a, a little special on him, and you'll see what all I have for him, so we're going to go ahead and see if we can just, um, I want to have her come over and take the invigorating elixir, we'll conjure not conjure, but we'll we'll do a good luck charm and we'll see if we can win something. Okay, I went to save really, really quickly. The way my game has been acting. It seems like there's certain certain ones, certain families that I play that that, uh, that will um, do that to me here. So we're going to go ahead and I'm going to... Let's go ahead and have her take the invigorating elixir because she is starting to get a little tired and I really want to have her um, be here until, you know, be here until we can see if we can get um, 
see if we can get some money. Let's see, we're invigorating elixir. Yep, so we're gonna go ahead and drink elixir. Become best friends with Sirius. We're gonna do that. Learn ceviche recipe. Yeah, she's gonna drink the elixir. Nuba Zimju. And then uh, cast charm. Good luck charm. Zanza Baska. And then let's come over here and play for some high stakes. And her energy popped up a little bit, but it should stay for about six hours, so we should be pretty good. We should be awfully good. Let's see what kind of money we can see what kind of money we can win. Well, we're thunderstorming here. <laughs> But we're pretty safe yes. here. Ooh. We got something. Okay, Invigorating Elixir was great. Juliana Black feels like she can do anything without using too much energy. Okay, so good. Alright, we can win. We can win something. She won a little bit, but... Alright, let's see what we can do here. Too spicy. <laughs> for food. Uh, losing streak. Oh my. Having a blast. Well, she got something. Fulfilled. Summer fun. And feeling lucky. Come on. I don't want to have to switch machines. Come on. Aww. See, that guy won a jackpot. See, that guy won something. We need to win. We might have to switch slot machines. We'll do a couple more pulls and see what happens. Well, we got a little something, but... Yeah. Oh, man. See, we need to win. And we cast a good luck charm on ourselves, too. We'll do a couple more pulls and see what happens here. Uh, let's get off of this one and let's come over here to... We'll do some high stakes again on this one. See, they're winning over there. That's not fair. That's not fair. I guess if we don't have any luck, we can just perform for some tips. We can just perform for some tips and see what happens. Ooh! We got something from this one. Very good. Alright, let's see if the slot machine will treat us better. All right, let's see what happens here. Come on, Juliana. Uh. See, they're winning over there. That's that's crazy. I want that slot machine. <laughs> Ooh, all right, all right. I'm saving real quickly so we don't lose it. All right, we're back. Yeah, she definitely got a jackpot. <laughs> All right. Do it again. Not that I'm trying to be greedy or anything, but, you know, it's always nice. Winning money is always nice, so what the heck. Mm. 
See, they're winning over there a lot. Oh my gosh. Jeepers. All right. So we won a jackpot of 5,000 simoleons. Oh. Wow. Awesome. Okay, let's try it again. So I think we're doing a little better on this slot machine, which is good. Which is good. Or so we thought. <laughs> but we'll we'll do a few more. We've got like a few more hours before we have to go home anyway. So. And her invig invigorating elixir is still doing pretty good, so she's not going to run out of energy. All right. More, 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 more. <laughs> Yay. Oh, my goodness. We're winning it now. Mordo. Oh, that's okay. We got two jackpots. See, they got a jackpot over there. Come on, Juliana. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Woo! More! Holy smoke! Oh my goodness! All right, Juliana. Come on, girlfriend. Come on, girlfriend. We can do it. See, they're getting all kinds of jackpots over there. That's crazy. They're getting all kinds of jackpots over there. Now, I think if you get your handiness skill up high enough, you might be able to fiddle with these and, and you know, so you win a little bit more often. So, yeah. All right. Okay. So we got we got like a half an hour before we have to go home, but we'll see if we can I wanna win like one more jackpot. Zombies are spawning up out there. Okay, we'll just do a couple more pulls and well we'll wait till about two o'clock and then we're gonna have to go home. I think she's got time for one more pull and then they're gonna kick us out of here. Nope. Yep, that's it. That's it. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and go on home. And we've got like 11,000 simoleons. 11,000 and... 300 and something simoleons. So that's that's good. We'll come back and do some more and we'll do some major upgrading of our house at some point. I want to get a little bit more money before I do that though. We could actually buy some more recipes and stuff. We'll go ahead on in. All right, so um, yeah, we, we definitely need to, we should uh, come out and, well, it's, it's not thundering right now. Let's go ahead and come out and see if we can do something with our bees. So let's go ahead and smoke the box. We'll clean the box, feed the bees, and harvest the honey. Oh, and a zombie just spawned out there. And we've got wind chimes. And we can actually buy some more, we can actually buy some recipes too. So, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and have her research some alchemy a few times. And then we'll go ahead and, and uh, mix, mix up a little something. We'll see how our invigorating elixir is gonna do. And there goes our wind chimes, yay.
hygiene. She does smell, but that's okay. We can send her into her shower before she goes off to bed. So she had a pretty nice leisure day, I must say. <laughs> She got to know, uh, she got to know Sirius and is a friend of his now, and so that's good. They got to meet, and, um, she won a couple of jackpots at the casino. She had a really nice time at the festival, except for the rain. I wish it didn't storm during the leisure day, but yeah. All right. So back inside to do some alchemy here. She doesn't have to pee too bad. I mean, she's starting to have to pee, but... And then we'll go ahead and have her mix a couple of things while we're here as well. And she can actually read some recipes and stuff. Her cooking skill is still at level 3, I think. Yeah, she's still got a level three cooking skill, so. Oh, gambling, she's got a uh, level six. I wonder what happens if you master it. I don't think anything really happens. Simoleon's lost. Okay, so Simoleon's won. She won 52,000, uh, 162 Simoleons. Game's lost. Okay, game's won. All right, yeah. So it just kind of keeps track of your stats, I guess. Okay, alchemy, she's at level... Three. All right. So yeah, that that skill journal is pretty is pretty handy. It's pretty handy. Hmm. Ah, okay, so she knows melancholy serum. Improve alchemy skill. Yes, she wants to do that. I'm gonna take off the ceviche mm. recipe and do the improve ah. alchemy skill because that's worth that's worth a few more lifetime happiness points. So, which we're about to do. I think we're going to improve it by the time she gets done researching and mixing here. And she'll get to level four. Okay, so she knows Flask of Sleep. I think we're about to get to a level four here pretty soon. We'll speed that up while she reads that to speed two. Okay. All right, so she's about to level up. She knows Jar of Discord. And there go the wind chimes. Yay! I love the wind chimes. Oh, and she is starting to get hungry. All right. Actually, she'll need to use the bathroom. So she can do that before she mixes things. And... Oh, bits. Yep. Uh -huh. Go to the bathroom. Now, um, I wanted to also show you... Oh, and I, I will show you where the, the blacks live. So this is this is uh, Juliana's house right here, but this is where the... This is where um, Sirius lives with his wife. And... In the part that I tried to record before my thing crashed, um, yeah, when I tried to record this before, um, I went to have her visit them, and uh, so this is this is where they live. So she can actually go visit them if she wants to. Um, yep, she could do that. Now, also, I fixed up her kitchen because the counters, um, the counters were not against the wall; they were kind of sticking. 
out a little bit. We had like a big space between this wall and where the counters were. And uh, yeah, so I had to fix that up. And so I ended up um, moving some things around and I ended up getting like a couple more counters so that it would be better. <laughs> All right, so now she's gonna go ahead and she's gonna go ahead and uh, mix mix a couple of things, and we'll have her take a shower. And her energy is still doing pretty well. I might have to give her another invigorating elixir because when she crashes, I think she's really gonna crash. So she's still researching. She knows ad nauseum, and she's at level four now. Oh, a Simfest is starting at Flying Bee's Coffee House. We'll have to go and perform for some tips to up her singing career as well. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and, all right, let's see what she can make here. Let's go ahead and have her make another invigorating elixir. Okay. Because this will definitely help her energy. Uh, she wants to improve alchemy skill again here. By a washing machine. Hmm. Hmm, not right now. Maybe later. Now, last time when uh, when I did this series, she ended up getting nauseous, and so she was puking, and I and I was going, "All right, why is she puking? Why is she sick?" But if they fail on um, if they fail like on an alchemy um, attempt, they will get nauseous, and sometimes they will even get nauseous even if they don't fail. Like alchemy can make them nauseous, so that's why that's why she was puking. That's why she was puking. Uh, let's have her make a cure elixir. Because she hasn't made one of those yet. So we'll do that. And she's halfway to getting to level 5 already. So we're going to have to get her a shower as soon as she's done here and get her something to eat. We'll take another invigorating elixir and then we'll go and perform for some tips. Hopefully she'll be able to do it. Because sometimes if they're not in a really good mood, they won't be able to do it. But, I mean, she's still in the green. It's just she really needs a shower. Because she smells. Alright, looks like she did it. All right, so let's go ahead and get her a shower. Uh, clean this. Take shower with flair. How about some leftover? How about have some te teppanyaki chicken fried rice? Very hungry. I know. I know. Time left 24 hours. I know. We're going to fix that right now. Dirty surroundings. Unfinished room. I don't know why it's unfinished. Yeah, I don't know why the... Why it's saying the Oh, I know why the room is unfinished. Okay. We need to paint a wall here. Just give me a minute, guys. Come on. There. There we go. All right, 
There we go. Now we're good. So we'll have to have her clean house too. Fulfilled, feeling lucky. Yep. And her lucky mood is going to last like another seven hours. I don't think she has another opportunity or anything, so. Yeah. All right, mm. there we go. Now you're doing good. So we'll clean this up. Let's go ahead and pee. Oh, we need to clean it. Let's go ahead and take another invigorating elixir. Okay. Lovely wind chimes. I love it. Love it. Okay, we have uh, 25 festival tickets. All right. Okay, drink your elixir. Yep. There we go. Now go ahead and wash your hands. You can brush your teeth. And then we're going to go and perform for some tips while your energy is going to hold out here. All right, while she's doing that, let's uh let's see where we can go. Well, there's people here. Let's go ahead and go here. Um, I'm just gonna have her go to around like M and, M and B and we'll perform for some tips there. And I do need to cancel this newspaper and all that good stuff. On the little broom. I can't remember how, how, um, okay, now she, she kind of went toward the back. I need to have her come here. Yeah, why don't you, why don't you go here? Yeah, go here. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and, uh, perform for some tips. Perform for tips. All right. I went to save and uh, I went to save and just kind of uh, freshen things up a little bit here. So, dude, she's going to do Oogie Fever. <laughs> Hopefully there'll be some people out here to watch. Yeah. Let's see how far she is to leveling up. And she should be okay for a while. Her energy is like halfway down the green, but yeah. Let's see, she's, oh, she's gonna level up here really quickly. Very, very quickly. And then we should be able to get some uh, gigs at the uh, private venues, I think, or live show venues, not private venues, but live show venues. She's gonna level up to level five here in just a little bit. Hopefully she will be able to um, get that on this on this performance here. So we'll put that on speed two. We'll just kind of keep a good eye. It's almost there. Almost there. Okay, one more great day. I think if she keeps this up, she'll go ahead and get that. Yeah. Um, oh, perform job. We can do that. We do have singograms, which we do need to do. Yes. Uh, the spot looks like the place to be. 
great ambiance, entertainment, blah, 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 blah. Yep. So we can always go in there and visit, but yeah. Um, we'll have her do this for a little bit. See if she'll level up with the tips here. I don't think there's anybody out here watching is the thing. But that's okay. So, she's having a blast. A uh, great meal, okay. Feeling lucky. <laughs> uh, minty breath, yep, and invigorated. So, so she is in a really, really good mood. And if she levels up, she'll be even, even in a better mood. <laughs> and we could actually have her throw a party because we have enough money to get a stereo and some tables and stuff. And we could throw a feast party, which I want to do that. And then here's another job for her to do. Yeah. Okay, we'll have her... There's nobody out here watching. I should have maybe taken her to the Cake Pleasure Dome, but yeah. Oh, I think she leveled up. Yep, let's see. Share this memory. Um... We have so much in common, blah, blah, blah. All right, so yeah, she leveled up. Congratulations, Juliana has been conferred the new title of Local Phenomenon by the Starlight Shores Town Council in recognition of her valuable contribution to the workforce. You're getting good, and this is no time to, uh, this is no time to be humble. Get out there and tell people how good you are. Uh, even back it up with an awesome new song. Okay, so she now makes 640 bucks per week. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and we'll go ahead and have her stop and then we'll do our, we'll go ahead and do our uh, singograms. And then, uh, I think by the time we get that done, hopefully we might be able to come back and audition for a couple of gigs. Okay. So she's all happy. Happy, happy, happy. Alright, so she's gonna go ahead and... Well, she doesn't have too far to go, which is good. So she'll do the singogram. Let's see what she gets for this. <laughs> Alright, she got 131 bucks for that one. We got a few more to do here. I think this one would be the same one, so we don't need to do that one. So there's three more that she needs to do. Okay. Oh, this is a nice, nice place. <laughs> there it goes. So she gets some money from that one. Let's go ahead and ignore this call. Uh, go to the hospital and perform uh, for the sick kids. Yes, we can do that. And I think I'd better try to save this because I'm going to get messed up here. Okay, guys, we're back. Yeah, when my screen when my screen goes really nuts like that, um, that's when my game decides to go really wonky. So anyway, um, she's got her singograms done. We didn't get the opportunity again to you know to um, do the hospital thing, but that's okay. We'll probably get that again. Um, but we're gonna see if we can get a gig at uh, Rodeo Go Go. She's got her. Come on, here we go. She's got her um, singograms done. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and audition for a singer gig. Hopefully she'll get this now that she's at level five. Because these are the uh, live show venues. And so hopefully, hopefully, hopefully she'll get a gig. I'll have her go here and I'll have her go to uh, Mixmaster Karaoke. Let's see if she'll get it here. Oh, 
Lassi. Okay, though you'll likely never admit it. Uh, okay, you made it big. You just performed a singogram, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so. Um, oh, you're not quite up to this venue standards. Oh, okay. But usually when you hit at least level five, you can, you can um, do that. Well, well, let's see if we can. I don't think we'll get M and B, but let's just, we can try it. We can try it. Because I think M and B is like a step up from Rodeo Go Go and stuff, so I don't know. I unless I got them mixed up. I don't know, but so I think this is like a private club. Well, we'll see what happens. We probably won't get this one either, but yeah. Grafu. All right, let's see what happens here. Okay, where's our message? Oh, your audition was great, Juliana Black. Uh, we'd love to have you perform at M and Well, gosh, I was wrong. Okay, so. Friday at 6.30 p.m. All right. All righty, all righty, all righty. Let's see what else that we can audition for here. I know we can't get the big show venues because we have to be way, way up there. I mean, way, way, way up there. We could try to get another one at the coffee house, but... Well, maybe we will. Let's Let's go ahead and do it. Oh, we can't. Let's see. That's Rodeo Go Go. Okay, let's try Mix Master Karaoke. I don't know that we're going to get this one, but let's try it. Yeah, we'll tr we'll try it. At least we got M and B, which is good. Alright, let's see what happens. Okay, let's see what happens here. Um, oh, you're not quite up to this venue standards. Well, let's go back to the coffee house. Yeah, I didn't think we'd get, if we can't get um, Rodeo Go Go, we usually won't get Mix Masters Karaoke, but we can, you know, I mean, it was worth a shot. <laughs> We'll just have to get up a level and do that again. Um, let's go back to the coffee house. Okay, let's go ahead and, and audition for the coffee house again. I'm sure we'll get that one because we've already been there. So we'll at least get a couple of a couple of them lined up and we'll get we'll get some money for that. Oh, somebody's got a tablet. Okay, so we should get this one. All right. Okay, your audition was great, Juliana Black. We'd love to have you at Flying Beast Coffee House um, at Saturday at 5 p.m. All right, so we're we're doing good. We're doing good. Um, and she is really getting tired. We're, we're just going to go ahead and send her on home um, because she is getting pretty tired. So we'll have her just go on to, to bed, and we'll have her actually get some decent sleep. Come on. Yeah, we'll have her get some decent sleep and um Come on. Okay, here we go. It would help if we got home here. It would help if I got her here, <laughs> clicked on her or whatever, but cuz she got way ahead of us. Um let's see if we have any bills or anything. Okay, pay bills, 290 something bucks. It's not bad. We'll do that. She's hungry. Okay. 
go ahead and have leftover teppanyaki chicken fried rice. We'll do that. And then we'll end up cooking something, but yeah. And I think we'll go ahead and have her go ahead and pee. We'll take her shower. See if she cleans this up first. And then we'll go ahead and go on to bed. You didn't eat this, did you? Yeah, you need to you need to eat this. Okay, why can't you eat that? Well, hmm. Well, let's uh, let's clean it up, I guess, and then uh, you go ahead and have leftover. Oops, leftover apple pancakes, I guess, because since you don't want to eat your chicken. Clean all that up. That's good. So I don't want her to wait till morning to eat because, you know, then she's going to be really hungry. All right, there we go. That's good. clean this up there we go and we're gonna go ahead and send her to sleep and I think this is a good place to end this part I think we got quite a bit accomplished um, we made really good friends with uh, Sirius we got a couple of gigs we got some money <laughs> yeah so we're, we're doing pretty good and I think there's a couple of things that I'm probably gonna end up uh, getting for her but anyway you guys have a fantastic day subscribe and uh, to see more like this plus all the other series that you may be interested in seeing uh, give this a thumbs up, hit the crap out of that like button, and um, leave a comment, tell me what you think. Ooh, thunderstorm! <laughs> and we'll see you guys in the next part. You guys have a fantastic day. Bye, guys.